This isn't just another garage project. This is a mission, a quiet revolution unfolding behind a regular door with an irregular vision. While the world sleeps under the weight of fossil fuels and corporate monopolies, something remarkable is taking shape. No fear, no greed. Just pure open source innovation powered by magnets, coils, and the belief that free energy is not fiction. For the last 15 years, this dream has been brewing through buried patents, suppressed tech, and sleepless nights. Now, it's almost ready, and you're invited to witness it unfold. A future beyond limits. A system beyond control. Ready? Let's dive in. The journey begins. From obsession to purpose. Fifteen years ago, this was nothing more than a spark, a curiosity, a question that refused to die. Could energy exist all around us, waiting to be harnessed? Could a simple coil of wire and a magnet unlock something the world wasn't ready to admit? Back then, it sounded like science fiction, but I couldn't look away. I started digging through obscure patents, old schematics, and whispers of technologies that had never seen the light of day. Names like Bedini, Bearden, and Tesla came up again and again. The more I studied, the clearer it became. Someone, somewhere, didn't want this knowledge to spread. So I built, prototype after prototype. Some worked for seconds, others burned out in minutes. I got my degree in electrical engineering, not to get a job, but to understand what they never taught us. Why do all our energy systems rely on control, consumption, and waste? Why do we ignore the ocean of energy around us? Then came a shift. This wasn't about proving anyone wrong. It became about proving a future right. A future where clean energy doesn't need to be rationed, patented, or controlled. Where a kid with some magnets and wire can change the way we power our lives. It's no longer a theory. The components are real. The machines are being built. And we're not hiding any of it. Everything will be open source. Because this isn't about ownership. It's about unlocking what belongs to all of us. The science behind the magic. At the heart of this technology is something deceptively simple. Wire and magnets. That's it. No exotic materials. No hidden fuel. Just a coil of copper wire and a few powerful magnets, arranged with intention. When you send current through the coil, a magnetic field is created. Reverse the current, and the magnetic field flips. This basic principle is what powers electric motors, generators, and even your phone's vibration motor. But here's where it gets interesting. Instead of a steady flow of current, we pulse it. Quick, precise bursts of energy timed with the motion of the magnets. That pulse creates a temporary magnetic field that sets the rotor spinning. Then, when the power cuts off, the magnetic field collapses. And that collapse? It sends out a sharp, high-voltage spike known as flyback energy. We don't let that energy go to waste. We capture it. By feeding that spike into a second battery bank, we're not just recycling energy, we're accessing something more. Something beyond. The system starts giving back more than we put in. And that right there, challenges everything we've been told about what's possible with energy. Tapping the ocean of energy. Most people think energy only comes from burning fuel, capturing sunlight, or spinning turbines. But what if that's only scratching the surface? What if there's an invisible ocean of energy surrounding us, always present, always accessible, just waiting for the right key? That's the real heart of this project. When we pulse high voltage into a lead-acid battery, especially using the sharp flyback spikes from our coil, it opens something called a dipole.
Think of it like cracking open a door to the vacuum itself. Not empty space, but space filled with raw potential. This isn't fantasy. It's supported by known electrical effects. Only most people don't ask the deeper questions. By triggering these pulses correctly, we access energy not from the battery alone, but from the environment, from the fabric of space around us. Similar to how solar panels capture sunlight, we're capturing invisible fields, fields that have been ignored, misunderstood, or outright denied. We're not breaking the laws of physics. We're simply applying them differently. This is energy not controlled by a power company, not measured in monthly bills. It's clean, abundant, and already here. We just have to reach out and use it. Now first, like always, be sure to hit the like button down below. It helps us out tremendously with the reach of this video. Thank you. Building the machine. Sweat, wire, and precision. No lab coats, no corporate funding. Just long days, calloused hands, and a garage filled with parts. This isn't theory anymore. It's a machine taking shape piece by piece. Every coil is wound by hand. Every wire is carefully laid, twisted, and inspected. It's slow, physical work. But every turn of the drill, every loop of copper, is a step closer to something extraordinary. I spent hours in an open field winding 250 foot lengths of wire, eight strands at a time, just to build two coils. That's hundreds of feet twisted, aligned, and carefully spooled. Back in the shop, I built a makeshift lathe using aluminum channels, ready rods, and my drill. It's not glamorous, but it works. And it matters. Each coil gets epoxied and secured to ensure zero short circuits. Even a single scratch on the wire could ruin everything. That's the level of care we're dealing with. Because this isn't about speed, it's about precision. We're using silicon carbide MOSFETs instead of transistors. We've designed a high-speed rotor embedded with 16 magnets, precisely balanced. It's a blend of old-school craftsmanship and modern components. And with every part assembled, this vision becomes more real. Beyond the coil, into the future circuitry. The coils are just the beginning. To bring this technology to life, we need a brain. A control system that speaks the language of fast, clean, efficient switching. That's where Joe comes in. Joe Mullen, an electronics genius I connected with after posting the first video, has become a key part of this project. His passion for silicon carbide components matches mine, and together we're pushing this beyond anything that's come before. He's designing custom circuit boards that use high-frequency, high-voltage MOSFETs, components that switch faster and cleaner than traditional transistors. The old Bedini-style circuits worked, but they were limited by slow switching and iron cores. We're moving past that. No more compromises. Joe's boards are built for speed, for efficiency, for real-world performance. These aren't recycled concepts from decades ago. They're built with today's best tech. Once the boards are back from manufacturing, we'll begin testing them with the new coils and high-speed rotor. Optical sensors will time the pulses with precision. Everything's designed to be modular, scalable, and open source. This isn't just an experiment. It's a blueprint for the next generation of energy systems. And we're building it. One wire, one board, one breakthrough at a time. A community awakens. Shared vision, shared work. What started in a garage is now echoing across the world. After that first video went live, something incredible happened. People began reaching out. Builders, thinkers, engineers, and dreamers. From Ontario to Alberta and beyond, 
messages poured in. Not just encouragement, but real collaboration. Schematics, test results, even full builds like the Bedini motor Ryan sent from Alberta. Beautiful work, precise, passion-driven. This isn't a solo journey anymore. It's a movement, and it's growing fast. Every person who watches, comments, or shares becomes part of this unfolding story. Many of you have sent emails, offered tools, and even volunteered your skills. That energy, your energy, is fueling this project as much as any battery. It proves something vital. People are ready for a different kind of world. One not dictated by utility bills and centralized grids, but by shared knowledge and open hands. We're setting up a dedicated domain and email system to stay better connected. Crowdfunding is coming, not for profit, but for progress. To build faster, smarter, together. Because when we align our intentions, when we build not for control, but for community, everything changes. And that change has already begun. Over unity, chasing the impossible, proving the real. The word over unity makes people nervous. It challenges what we've been told is possible, that you can't get more energy out than you put in. But here's the truth. Over unity isn't about breaking physics. It's about tapping into energy we weren't counting before. We're not creating energy from nothing. We're accessing what's already there, hidden in the environment, ignored by mainstream systems. When a coil's magnetic field collapses, it gives back more than most systems capture. When that energy is harnessed correctly, recycled, and paired with the right switching components, something extraordinary happens. The machine starts giving more than it takes. Even if it's just one watt over unity, that's enough. Because one watt proves the principle. And once you prove it, you can replicate it, scale it, optimize it. That's the path we're on. Not chasing infinite energy, but measurable, repeatable proof that clean, ambient energy is real and usable. It's the kind of proof no authority can deny once it's in the hands of the people. And that's the mission. To prove this works. Not behind closed doors, but in garages, workshops, and homes around the world. Openly. Honestly. Together. This journey isn't just about coils and magnets. It's about reclaiming possibility. About daring to believe that energy doesn't have to be expensive, hidden, or controlled. From this garage to your screen, we're building something real. A clean, open-source future powered not by fear, but by shared intention. The machine is coming together. The community is forming. The questions we're asking are uncomfortable, but necessary. If you've felt it too, that quiet urge for something better, you're already part of this. Stay with us. Share this. Build with us. Because the next chapter isn't written by corporations. It's written by all of us, together.